Okay, we are recreating Pinterest outfits yet again today because it's one of my favorite, favorite things to do. One of my favorite videos to film. You guys seem to like it, so there's really no cons to this. So let's just dive into the first one. I kind of like have, okay, so this is someone actually that I repin a lot of her outfits. I'm not, I'm gonna put her name here, I have to find it. But this outfit in particular, I love so much. I think this is, okay, by the way, this is not like solely summer base. This is not solely fall base. I'm kind of just doing it to outfits as, that I would wear kind of right now and plan to wear going into the fall. Like, so not one or the other, kind of transitional. And this one I feel like is so perfect. I just love it so much. It's super casual with the leggings, the socks, the sneakers, and but I like the button up and the purse. They kind of elevate it. And so I also like the detail of like tying it around your waist like that. So we're gonna try to get as close as we can to this from pieces that I already own. What we have so far, I'm gonna stick some shoes on and then we have to make a decision because this I only have a black uh, button down and so I'm like wondering should the sweatshirt be black or navy I kind of am leaning towards navy with a bag how close do we get I like this outfit so much whenever I wear leggings I just wear them with a sweatshirt you know and I feel like you can easily dress them up and make them cute like this and I feel really cute in it but you can also like wear your stuff like this could be a like going to work out, run errands after kind of thing. You wear your workout stuff under and then like, this is your, you know, on the go stuff. I'm pretty close, I'm wearing my Jerf Avenue uh, brazy top in black and then these Lululemon leggings and then this is thrifted, the bag is coach and socks. I think they're Nikes actually, they're Jarrah's, but I stole them. <laughs> okay, for the next one, I think we're gonna go classic again because like I said, as soon as it starts like cooling down, I feel like I really gravitate towards that like, just classic, like kind of, elegant-ish style or chic I guess would be the word and I really like this outfit right here and so I'm going to go find some stuff like this and throw it together I just think it's like just so timeless and easy and comfortable looking too so okay I feel so chic in this outfit so obviously I switched out the pants because I have a pair of gray like trousers this black pair just kind of gave me the look that I wanted like super baggy these were from a recent thrift with me on top I'm wearing this cardigan from J Crew that I found on Poshmark for such a good deal I showed you guys my vlog but I freaking love this thing it's fuzzy and it gives some texture to the outfit if you can kind of tell from there and then the shoes I'm wearing I feel like top off like the chic vibe they just like make it that much more chic and they are by Vivea who is actually the sponsor of this portion of the video so thank you so much to Vivea for working Working with me on this and if you have not heard of Avea yet they're actually a sustainable footwear company and not only are all their shoes super chic and beautiful they're also eco-friendly and responsible and each pair of shoes you guys is made out of six plastic bottles that are taken from city waste and the ocean which is just crazy when you look at them and not only that but they actually are each made by using recycled materials and 3d technology and they've established a zero waste process and created a seamless 3d knit design for the ultimate combination of comfort and function I am like normal to wide feet like they land on the wider side and they just have like literally no issues with them and they kind of like stretch with your foot they're that material also all of their packaging is created using 100 percent recycled cardboard you can also follow them on instagram at the underscore official to get more information on their process and their products and all of that kind of stuff and i'm just so excited about them so let me show you the next pair too okay and then here we have the next look which is inspired by bridget bardot and i just chose like a printed pair of pants with this sweater and then i have my green vivea sling backs they're the iron wrist model on their site and you guys know how I feel about green shoes back stretches on them so there's like no blistering I've worn them out a few times now like I want to say three or four and I have not had one issue which is I cannot say the case about honestly all of the other flats I've ever had if they've taken time to break in but these have had no break in time and again green is a timeless color for me it's one of my favorites and I think that it brings so much to every outfit I love a pop of color in a shoe especially um so thank you again to Vivea for sponsoring if you guys want to check them out make sure you use my code cup 15 I'll link everything down in the description for you um back to this outfit uh Bridget Bardot I've been super into like 60s fashion I want to say she's 60s right um, I don't know if this picture in particular, but like Bridget Bardot in general, her street like street style, what she's wearing, going walking and different things like that. And I just love it so much. She was wearing like more floral pants, but I don't have floral pants. So I was going through these in pink gingham and I was like, no, I kind of like this look with the pop of color as the shoes. And then a pop of color here with the little like um, scarf. This one's from an antique store. And just some normal sunglasses. My uh, cat eye ones I feel like are very appropriate for this. Anyway, let's go on to the next one. I don't know if this should be zipped or not, but this is the outfit inspiration. I forgot to talk you through it beforehand, but this is one of those things, like, you know, on Pinterest, when you go to save something, 
and it tells you you've already saved it. And I've done that probably like three or four times to this picture because I just love it so much. I don't know, I'm pretty sure it's a Copenhagen like street style snap, <laughs> snap, who am I? Um, picture? Which are some of my favorite street style, probably my favorite ever actually is Copenhagen street style. I'll just leave it open for right now. Um, but yes, pants are Donnie, your shorts are Donnie, and then my little black loafers, which I really do think what drew me to this look was her loafers, to be honest, because I was just like, I, I just feel like it, it's kind of like, I always think of fleeces as more of like an outdoorsy thing or casual, and I feel like the loafers with it, I just, it's kind of more unexpected for me, and I just never think to pair them together. So, I really like it. This again is Vintage Patagonia from eBay, my Swifty merch, and some socks, and my New York Yankees hat or something. And then the next one I have is actually might be cheating, this next outfit, because I've been really liking like mini dresses with boots and stuff, and which is, I feel like a key Jane look in my opinion like a lot of what I see her in um, from past photos I don't know though I don't know much about her but I do see her a lot on my Pinterest anyway I got this dress I think it's gonna work really nice I'm gonna find my boots to go with it um, in this picture she has the dress on if I remember correctly I'm pretty sure she's wearing boots like knee-high boots okay here's the look this dress is a new purchase for me from Doen um, I got it on what I think it was their warehouse sale or something but it's just like this little mini dress the long sleeves it comes with this tie I don't know if I want it though for this look tie or no tie I don't know um, but that and then my little burger basket that is <laughs> serving as a home decor with fake flowers in it it kind of adds to the outfit the flowers kind of matches but here let me show you this print up top because it is so beautiful if you can see that I just think it's gorgeous and I've been dreaming of this dress for so long literally probably the exact start right before summer I looked at their site and I was going through their dresses and I had like five I mean I want everything on their site but this was in my top like five favorites and I was just like I I loved the pattern I love how short it is again with the boots and everything I don't know just love it um for the next one oh gosh okay hold on I got my iPhone I have it on a tripod but um Okay, this next one, we're going to do this one. The white on white with the black cowboy boots. I think this is going to be cute. This is super my style, especially right now. This is like the vibe I've been going for. And so I'm going to go find that skirt somewhere. I just literally don't know what I did before I had this skirt. The skirt is my... It's just so good. It's my favorite right now. I love pairing with anything. And like this outfit is exactly what I've been into again lately. Like, I, I don't know. It's just so easy and comfortable too. And I just feel like this skirt goes with basically anything. This still, I like this outfit so much. Probably on like my top five of like outfits. As soon as it gets like a little bit cooler, I will be wearing. And also I've been getting more into my cowboy boots lately. I feel like for a little bit this summer I was like, mm -mm -mm. And now I'm back in it. I just love them. They, really, they also do go with everything. Like cowboy boots, especially my black ones. I just feel like I find so many outfits where I'm like, that those are good. And then I put them on and they work. They just like are always good. For any occasion too. Dressing down and dressing up. The next one we have is this one. And it's going to be fairly easy. You know, just white dress with some loafs again. Um, but I have a couple to choose from. And I just like the vibe anyway of this outfit like the overall vibe of it okay i think this is pretty similar i think any like white dress would be similar but this one i got specifically to look like a doe dress but it was like way 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 cheaper um and then loafers because it's like very prairie girl vibes and i think that's what makes me like this outfit with the loafers i feel like again just like the juxtaposition of the two vibes mesh well you know um but just in general i like a white dress i always like a white dress they're just so key and also with like the uh socks i also just really like that detail so um also this is way airier oh my god i feel so refreshed in it pretty simple not much to it so we're gonna go to the next one now <laughs> okay so this one might actually be considered cheating ish well I, I guess not anyway uh there are no rules so you can't really cheat anyway so this instagram photo right here i've had saved for a while from I think it's at Madame Hawks Hawk I think I'm pretty sure anyway I follow her on Instagram and TikTok highly recommend she has great style but I do have the same sweater as her so it's the exact same well not the exact same outfit but you know what I mean like the same vibe if I had like a little I'll do my boat tote boat vibe although I wish it was just not red right now but um yeah anyway I love this outfit so much and this collar that I added is from eBay. I love these collars for this specific reason, just adding on a sweater and stuff. I feel like it just elevates it so much. Also, it's like adjustable, has like a little tie and stuff. Can't wait to wear this. I feel like I'm gonna recreate this. 
Oh, and also these are my thrifted black pants from earlier too. And then just some white sneakers. And yeah, super easy. Very comfortable too. These pants and the sweater together, it's like a good comfort outfit. Like I feel like these pants are gonna be great for when I'm like, on um, my period bloated, like crampy. It's like super baggy. <laughs> and I feel like I don't have a lot of those like kind of like trousery style pants in this fit. So that's why I like them too. But anyway, I think this one's gonna be the last fit we're gonna recreate because again, I feel like I'm tr I tried to like make them more transitional in this video, but I do want to do a fall, like a dedicated fall one of these um, soon. So look out for that. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss it. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. And also thank you again to Vivea for sponsoring. Make sure you check them out down below and on their Instagram. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Thank you.